Hey guys, so this week's video I wanted to talk to you about something that's really been bothering me the last several days to a week. Um, it's something that's personal that I wanted to share with you. Um, it's something that's been even affecting my ability to focus on a daily basis. Uh, my grandma turned 87 today, God bless her soul. Um, you know, I just love my grandma to pieces. I would do anything in the world for her. She means so much to me. Uh, she's a very special part of my life. And uh, she's always been there for me, uh, unconditionally. No matter what, she's always been there and loved me. So like I said, uh, my grandma turned 87 today. And uh, I guess what I wanted to talk to you about was that she's really... My grandmother is really... Oh, excuse me. Whoa, allergies. <laughs> so I guess what I wanted to talk to you guys about this week and share with you uh, was that, like I said, my grandma's turned 87 today, and it's come to my attention that in the last week, she has really, really declined mentally. Um, she's n unable to remember my name most of the time now. She's unable to use her telephone. She is trying to convey things to me and get you know, her thoughts across, but she can't put them into words, and, um, it's really hard, it's really, really hard to watch somebody that you love so much, um, to decline in a, you know, just to become demented, it's, um, it's heart-wrenching, uh, dementia is probably one of the, the nastiest forms of any disease that anyone can get because it just robs you of everything you know my grandma broke her hips both of our hips and sure she wasn't able to you know you know get around as easy as she used to be able to but she still had her mind and when you know as long as she had her mind she was perfectly fine she she made the most of anything um, but now that she's starting to lose her mind a little bit, um, what's left? The, the what's left in this life? Um, and I don't know what happens after that point. I really don't. I mean, I don't know what her thoughts are. I don't know what her feelings are. Um, it's just really hard to watch somebody that you love so much go through that. So there is a message behind this week's video, and uh, that is, life is short. I think it's important for each and every one of us uh, to continuously remind ourselves that we have a very limited time on this earth and that we really need to take a hard look at where we are in life uh, to make sure that we're living up to our you know fullest capabilities and capacities um, you know all of us should have goals and ambitions in life and we should be continuously working to progress and achieve those goals and ambitions um, so that when we get to be my grandma's age um, that you know we have something to look back on I think the biggest thing that's uh, really affected my grandma in the last year or so is that she hasn't been working her mind she uh, you know pretty much lays in bed she you know comes out to her living room and she watches TV she has her meals and you know she pets her kitty and that's about the extent of her day you know each day is not really there's not really much to look forward to in her day and she's just kinda lost it at the end I don't know what happened but I guess that's this video could also be for someone that might be of an older age uh, someone that's in their 60s 70s uh, that you need to continuously work your mind, do something with yourself so that you're always keeping this busy and that when you get to be my my grandma's age that your mind doesn't become, you know, dormant. I just wanted to ow, something bit me. That didn't feel very good. Okay, I'll stop talking, but um I just wanted to kind of share that with everyone and um you know, it's it's really hard to watch somebody you love so much go through the things that my grandmother is going through. You know, life is short in that each one of us, uh, whether we're 25 or 75, that we're taking a hard look at ourselves and where we are in life 
and that we are living life to its fullest potential. That's all I'm asking everyone. So, with that said, um, I will see you next Wednesday, and uh, if you want to leave a comment below, uh, feel free to do so. Otherwise, I will see everyone next Wednesday. Peace.